Hello friends, in this video we'll be discussing Z transform and this is our 7th example. So friends, this is our given example. We need to find Z transform of A raised to K upon K factorial. So we need to find Z transform of A raised to K upon K factorial. So this is the given problem. Let's start by definition of z transform z f of k is equal to summation of minus infinity to infinity f of k into z raised to minus k. So this is the formula of z transform. So here in this problem k is greater than equal to 0 that means we need to take positive value of the summation that is k is equal to 0 to infinity and in this interval this f of k is this that is a raised to k upon k factorial into z raised to minus k. So we substituted in this particular formula. Let's rearrange the term so k equal to 0 to infinity see the way I am writing a raised to k z raised to k raised to k upon k factorial so this arrangement is perfectly all right this z raised to minus k actually is in the denominator only so that will go down and that will become z raised to k let's substitute the values if i'll put k is equal to 0 so that will be a by z raised to 0 upon 0 factorial then i'm going to put 1 so a by z raised to 1 into 1 factorial plus a by z the whole square upon 2 factorial plus dot 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 which is equal to the first term is actually 1 because a by z raised to 0 is 1 and 0 factorial is also 1 so the entire term is 1 here a by z raised to 1 factorial upon 1 factorial a by z the whole square upon 2 factorial if we write the next term of the series, what will be that? a by z the whole cube upon 3 factorial plus dot dot dot. Now friends, can you identify series from this expression? No? Let me tell you what is the series. Remember the formula for e raised to x. What is that? 1 plus x upon 1 factorial x square upon 2 factorial x cube upon 3 factorial plus dot 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 and the same goes with e raised to minus x with alternate plus minus that is 1 minus x upon 1 factorial x square upon 2 factorial minus x cube upon 3 factorial plus dot 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 if you compare this with this given problem you can say this is x then this term is x square this term is x cube so actually this is 1 plus x plus x square upon 2 factorial plus x cube upon 3 factorial if you treat x as a by z so which is equal to e raised to x and x is a by z this is the z transform of f of k last thing is we need to write it on the roc for finding out the roc if you remember we do consider roc from the denominator if it is z minus a we'll say mod z greater than a if it is a minus z we'll say mod z less than a but here we don't have denominator therefore there is no restriction and roc is entire z plane hope you understood the problem thank you